St. Mary's serves 384 students in Saskatoon. The majority of those students are Indigenous. It's not clear how many are Catholic. Five years ago, the province spent millions of dollars to rebuild this inner city school, which now includes a smudging room, a wellness centre for the neighbourhood. As a school, like it's, we're part of the community, so that would really affect us. Like we'd have to go somewhere else and I don't think that's right. I think it should be for like anybody in the community. It would, it would affect her a lot because she, she just loves it here. Yeah, she does. <laughs> I've already been trying to get her to move and she won't. Well. Last week's ruling makes it clear. Catholics can stay, but by next year, the province must stop paying for everyone else at Catholic schools. That puts the Cree bilingual program at St. Francis into question. Cree is what's attracted most of this school's 550 students. Moving them is the wrong plan, according to the Federation of Sovereign Indigenous Nations. That was a wrong decision for, for sure. I mean, anytime you, you take away education opportunities for any child, it's it's not a good it's not a good decision. Saskatoon's Catholic schools will not say how many students they could lose. A number of families at St. Mary's tell CBC their children are not baptized, but they belong to the Saskatoon Tribal Council. Everybody needs a belief system, and whether they're Catholic or or not, I think it helps because I do know that uh, the Catholic school board certainly has incorporated a lot of the, the spiritual aspects of First Nations. Felix Thomas says the Tribal Council may have to create its own school board if it means Indigenous children can stay in classrooms like these. There is no word yet on whether the province or Catholic schools will file an appeal. This afternoon, though, Catholic schools in Saskatoon sent parents a letter asking them to contact elected officials and to urge those elected officials to take any measures necessary to keep paying for all students who choose to go to Catholic schools. Jennifer Cannell, CBC News, Saskatoon.